Some fun facts about the sun. The sun is a large star, but it is considered an average sized star in terms of its diameter. It has a diameter of about 1.4 million kilometers, 870,000 miles, which is approximately 109 times that of Earth. However, compared to other stars, the Sun is relatively small. It has a mass of approximately 1.989 times 10 to the 30 kilograms, which is about 333,000 times the mass of Earth. It accounts for about 99.86% of the total mass of the entire solar system. It is primarily composed of hydrogen, about 74% of its mass, and helium, about 24% of its mass. The remaining 2% consists of trace amounts of other elements such as oxygen, carbon, neon, and iron. The Sun has several distinct layers. The innermost core is the central region where nuclear fusion occurs converting hydrogen into helium and releasing an enormous amount of energy. Surrounding the core is the radiative zone, where energy is transported through radiation. The outermost layer is the convective zone, where energy is transported through the movement of hot plasma. Above the convective zone lies the visible surface of the sun, known as the photosphere. The temperature of the sun varies across its layers. The core is the hottest region, reaching temperatures of about 15 million degrees Celsius, 27 million degrees Fahrenheit. The temperature decreases with increasing distance from the core. The photosphere has an average temperature of about 5,500 degrees Celsius, 9,932 degrees Fahrenheit. The sun is an extremely powerful source of energy. It emits energy in the form of electromagnetic radiation, including visible light, ultraviolet, UV, light, and infrared, IR, radiation. The total power output of the sun is approximately 3.8 times 10 to the 26 watts. The Sun is an active star, and its activity is characterized by phenomena such as sunspots, solar flares, and coronal mass ejections. Sunspots are dark areas on the surface caused by intense magnetic activity, while solar flares are sudden, intense releases of energy. Coronal mass ejections CMEs, are massive eruptions of charged particles from the Sun's outer atmosphere, which can have an impact on Earth's magnetosphere and can cause geomagnetic storms. The Sun's activity follows a roughly 11-year solar cycle known as the sunspot cycle. During the solar cycle, the number of sunspots on the Sun's surface fluctuates, reaching a maximum, solar maximum, and minimum, solar minimum, over the course of approximately 11 years. The Sun constantly emits a stream of charged particles called the solar wind. This stream of particles, mostly protons and electrons, travels through the solar system at high speeds. The solar wind interacts with Earth's magnetosphere and is responsible for phenomena such as the auroras, northern and southern lights. It is approximately 4.6 billion years old and is considered to be middle-aged. It is estimated that the Sun has a total lifespan of about 10 billion years. Currently, it is in the main sequence phase of its life cycle, where it fuses hydrogen into helium. Eventually, the Sun will exhaust its hydrogen fuel and will evolve into a red giant, expanding and engulfing the inner planets, including Earth, before eventually shedding its outer layers and becoming a white dwarf. The Sun rotates on its axis, but different parts of the Sun rotate at different speeds. Near the equator, the Sun rotates once approximately every 25.4 days, while near the poles, it takes about 36 days to complete a rotation. This phenomenon is known as differential rotation. It has a strong magnetic field generated by the movement of charged particles within it. This magnetic field is responsible for the formation of sunspots, solar flares, and other solar activity. 
The magnetic field of the Sun also flips its polarity every approximately 11 years, coinciding with the solar cycle. The diameter of the Sun is not constant but undergoes small variations over time. These variations are known as solar diameter changes or solar pulsations. They occur due to the Sun's internal processes and gravitational interactions with the planets. A solar eclipse occurs when the Moon passes between the Sun and Earth, blocking the Sun's light. There are different types of solar eclipses, including total, partial, annular, and hybrid eclipses. Total solar eclipses, where the Moon completely covers the Sun, are rare and provide an opportunity to observe the Sun's outer atmosphere, called the corona. The Sun produces an enormous amount of neutrinos, subatomic particles with very little mass and no electrical charge. Neutrinos are created in the nuclear fusion reactions within the Sun's core and can pass through the Sun without being significantly absorbed. Neutrinos emitted by the Sun provide insights into the processes happening deep within it. The Sun loses a small amount of mass over time due to the emission of energy. Through the famous equation E equals mc squared, where E is energy and M is mass, it is estimated that the Sun loses about 4.3 million tons of mass per second. The Sun plays a crucial role in Earth's climate. Variations in solar activity, such as changes in the number of sunspots, can impact Earth's climate patterns. Although the Sun's influence on climate is relatively small compared to other factors like greenhouse gases, it can contribute to long-term climate variations. Scientists study the Sun using various ground-based and space-based observatories. Examples include the Solar Dynamics Observatory (SDO), the Solar and Heliospheric Observatory (SOHO), and the Parker Solar Probe. These observatories provide detailed observations of the Sun's surface, magnetic field, solar wind, and other phenomena. The Sun is an abundant source of energy. and solar power technologies harness its energy for various applications. Solar panels convert sunlight into electricity through the photovoltaic effect, providing a renewable and clean source of power. The sun is crucial for supporting life on Earth. It provides heat and light, which drive weather patterns, photosynthesis in plants, and the Earth's climate system. The Sun's energy is the ultimate source of energy for almost all life forms on our planet. Life is impossible without the Sun. I hope you enjoy watching. Don't forget to like and share this video. Subscribe to Fun Facts Online channel for more fun facts. Thanks for watching.